I knew it would lead to this day. Like everything we've done has led us here and it's going to be the most amazing day. This is the start of the rest of our lives together. I love you so much and I can't wait to see you at church. Next, welcome to our family. You're extremely lucky to have Carol in your life. Carol, I learn from you every day how to be kind, patient, and loving. <laughs> I didn't want to cry. <laughs> I thank God for giving me the most amazing person to share my life with. You've supported me and given me the confidence to be where I am today. Pray that God gives us both the grace so that we can constantly strive towards Him. In doing so, care for one another even more deeply. As a little girl, Carol would always hold my hand everywhere we go. Today, I'm the one that cried tears of joy when I saw my beautiful daughter, who is not little girl anymore, marry the man of her dream. prayed together, we've shared new experiences together, we've laughed together and most importantly we've grown together. Through it all I've gotten to know the max that no one else knows the way I do. I'm so thankful that Paul put me on drinks with you one fateful afternoon at Coco's. Who knew it would even lead to this day? Max, I've never heard you talk the way you do about another person the way you do about Carol. With complete romance and love filling your eyes, I've heard you say things like, Carol's a boss, bro. <laughs> yeah. I felt comfortable. She's the right guy for Carol. I found Max to be polite, lovely man, but very big beard. The day of the proposal, Max booked Tetsuya's, which is a fine dining restaurant. We went to a park right after. We took the ferry out to Darling Park. My sisters were doing the setup for the proposal. The last text they said was, don't come up to the right side, come the left. And I saw that and I'm like, okay, go up the right side. We went up the wrong way. <laughs> so we ended up seeing his dad. Carol looks at me, she's like, hey, is that your dad? And I was like, no. And then my dad turns around and walks straight off. Why is Max's dad here? Why is he upset with me? She was really shocked. She's like, no, but that was your dad. I'm like, no, I don't think so. Max kind of freaked out, shifted me a little bit to the right, and we walked straight into the proposal. She realizes after what's happening, oh, that was a fun day.